This is Steven's sausage roll. <laughs> uh, this is probably the single most requested game I have ever gotten. This is potentially a, one of the best puzzle games ever made from what I've heard. Both the creators of Baba Is You and The Witness have said that this is their favorite puzzle game of all time. So if that doesn't get you hyped up, I don't know what will. Uh, I've heard that and I've heard that this game is also very hard. Those two things combined should uh, make for a very interesting play. Let's uh, let's do this. So here, this is Steven. All right, move around arrow keys. WSD works as well. He turns. Jeez, we can walk backwards. So I feel like the difficulty of this game is the movement system. We have a little sausage kind of pricker. Hold on, is it possible for me to go up? I should probably try to figure that out. I should have looked at the controls more. Learned people cast great shadows. Looks like we're meant to go here. The Anchorage. That's all right. So the object of the game is to get the sausages onto their platters, I guess, without burning him. This isn't the first level. Oh my God. For real? Okay, hold on. Yeah, you're right. I should find the first level. That's pretty weird. This one looks even easier. South Jaunt. So we, there's probably a lot of different ways to hit sausages. This, I imagine, is one of them. This, okay, this one looks way easier. That doesn't win? Do we have to cook both sides of the sausage? Okay, I see, I see. All right, here's a new idea then. We roll it twice. Like that. Wait, but now we need to get it out of the way for the other sausage. Is there a way to pick up the sausage? That's a good question. Like, the thing is, now no matter what I do, I'm gonna burn the sausage. So obviously I've screwed myself, because that burns the leftmost sausage. What could be nice is, is if I could um, be able to push a sausage up. Actually, I do see a way to do that. What I could do is move this here and then get this to go up. Yes, up we go. Um, but what I would like to do is walk backwards so I don't accidentally, okay, okay, is so I don't screw myself. So I want to get this out of the way here because what I would want to do is roll this sausage over to here. And now I could even get it out of the way here. And now all I need to do is just get the other sausage over. Let me leave it here though. This seems like the spot. What I can do is move this over once. Maybe walk backwards twice and then push it down again. So then get you out of the way and then move on over. Roll you twice. Ooh, got to be careful. Wait, I've cooked them both. They don't have to stay on the burners. They just have to be cooked. So that's a win. There we go. We beat our first level. Very strange movement. Holy crap, this game's going to be hard. If that's probably, that's probably the easiest level in the game, that's going to be nuts. <laughs> um, so here's how I describe the movement. Like... As you change arrow keys, you turn, but there is no button to turn. I only have the arrow keys to move. So if I want to turn facing up, I have to push up. If I want to turn facing left, I have to press left, but I can only be in the direction adjacent to it. There's no strafing. There's only turning and moving forwards and backwards. So let's try here. Infants break. I imagine I have to start by moving backwards, but there's two ways I could go about that. All right, so let's try a simple cook. Jesse, we have to cook sausages. That being said, I, f I have a feeling this sausage that's over here is kind of screwed. That looks pretty burnt to me. I'm going to actually reset and not back it up. But that's bad too. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Uh-oh. Um, yeah, let's, let's, let's move in this direction. And what I would like to do is go here and then push the sausage this way. Why this way? Um, uh, it's convenient. Can I move? I can push it down like that. The sausages push each, push each other. Okay, that looks pretty good for a start, I think. Because then what I want to do is push it this way and then over again. The horizon or the one that's vertical seems pretty self-explanatory. Because I'll eventually just push it left twice. But the other one seems a little bit challenging. The one that's horizontal, I got to actually cook up a plan for. So let me let me do this here. And then let me go down. And then I would want, like you to go over. Like that. So that that's fine. Maybe what I need to do then is take the other sausage, set it up a little better. Like, so I can free it, basically. I have the L in the uh, the bottom right of this. So that could probably get three quarters of the sausage. Actually, that could get all of the sausage. I 100% see a way to get all the sausage, but I need to back up. Get So get this out of the way. And then get this to go left. And then what I can do is move backwards. Not like that. Put, cook that, cook that, and then turn it over. Let's go. Let's freaking go. I am the sausage master. Arrow keys the move. Okay, wait, so maybe this is an easier level. 
Okay, not what I meant to do. Maybe this is an easier level. It's one sausage. How bad could it? It looks pretty bad, huh? Um, what I maybe want to do is cook one half at a time. Honestly, that might be it. Here's what I'm thinking. I move this down, and then I roll this over like such. And then I kind of come on over here and bring it back. So the reason why I want to bring it back is so that I can use the top right burner to cook both sides of the other sausage. Whoops. Like that. Back and around and then over. And then all we need to do is grill that. And we should have a win here. Nice. Let's go. Even faster. But we're finding the sausage way. Worship the sausage. Love the sausage. Let's try down here. Fiery jut. Looks like I gotta be smart with how I cook these. I feel like one's just gotta go up, one's gotta go down. Can I just roll them both like this? Well, no, actually. Because I only half cook one, and then one's gonna burn. That's devilish. Like, I wanted to see if I could mess with this, but that just burns it as well. I could try to, like... Okay, I actually can back into that. That's good to know. I think I'm gonna restart just so I can have a fresh perspective. Maybe it's, like, easier from here. Just the only thing is it's that second sausage. Sausage number two has got to be better? Can I... What about this? This allows me to move sausage number two. And actually, that could be really good. Because what I can do is now that sausage number two is moved, push sausage number one up and save the day. <laughs> good one. Let's go. <laughs> the ultimate sausage production. Let's uh let's do this. C finger. Okay, we really don't have much movement space. Wait, can I get to that island over there? No, I must use the sausage to push the sausage. Well, I can do that. That seems kind of bad. Well, I could probably do this, and then I can move it up like that, and that probably is enough. That looks winning to me. Very nice. Probably the easiest level yet. We are tearing through these like nobody's business. Merchant's Elegy. The burners here are quite strange. I feel like I want to get one sausage out of the way, at least a little bit. I might just have it here. What I'm going to do is then push this off. Because I was thinking like what I could do would be... Ah, crud. I guess I can do this still. I don't like that. I don't like that. Like, I want to manipulate the other sausage right now. But that's no good because I can't bring it back down. Because I was thinking now that it's out of the way, I could use this to hit up both. But that doesn't make much sense. Wait, it can go... Oh, I can purchase sausage here. What was I thinking? Where these two squares I can purchase sausage at. That's got to be the, the key to the puzzle. Because then what I can do is free the sausage and then have it hit both. Okay, now that I found that, this level shouldn't be too bad. Oh, but I can't perch the sausage until it's done. All right, let's back it up a little bit. How do I want to end? Which sausage is the final sausage? So once that once once this is here, like I can't actually bring it back because it's always going to burn. So I have to have either a finished sausage here or a finish, finish the sausage here. Oh God, but this looks even worse. Damn, this level looked way easier than it actually is. My sausage manipulating skills are to be desired. <gasps> I have a different idea. I see how I can free the sausage. Here's what I'm thinking. This sausage on, whoops, the left here can go here. And then what I can do is bring it up like this. So now we can come back. Yeah, now we could bring it back hypothetically. Oh, let me just run this. I feel like I'm still missing a little bit of something, but it feels very close. Like doing an idea like that, I think gets me at least a little bit of the way. All right, so you need to get out of the way. Uh, you can actually dangle off the edge now. You can go into no man's land because you're cooked. I feel like this should be an auto win from here. Because what I can do is back up and then rotate it across here. And now I have the full side cooked and then I can push it down over and win. Let's go. Let's freaking go. <laughs> um, nice. Making good progress. Let's keep this going. Happy pool. All right, so there's only two burners. So we're going to have to do some sausage sliding here, I imagine. Where is the entrance point? Probably on the bottom one, if I had to guess. Bottom left? I think we want to get it down here. Let's try that idea. Oh, interesting. Right, I can't walk off the edge. But I can walk like this. So what I can do is slide it, slide it, and then roll it. 
and then slide it again and that should win. We've done it. All right, also probably the easiest level so far. I feel like the level at the very bottom is way harder than it deserves to be. Like, what is the deal with this? Comely Hearth. Three burners, two sausages, one dream. Open a small business. I'm gonna do what seems like be the most... No, that's that can't be right. I could probably start like this, though. I kind of want to just get it out of the way, though. I feel like I should have probably done some stuff with the extra sausage. But that's fine. What I can do is roll this down. I guess it's not fully screwed, right? Let me see if I can save it. So what I first need to do, though, is actually get this one out of here so it doesn't burn. And then I need to bring it back like this. Then you just come here. And then I was thinking I would have it come down. That doesn't make much sense. Wait, I could still do that, though. I could do it like this and then have this be at the very bottom and then just get the bottom corner last. But then I have to get the other sausage. So can I actually get there? Maybe, yes. What I can do is this and then get you out of the way. You're cooked. So then the other sausage uh, cooking shouldn't be too shabby. Wait, here's an idea, here's an idea. I push it up and then I push it over and then I push the two of them up. Yes, how do you like that? And then push this down. Oh, I can't push it down just yet. I can push it down now, though. Back up. Move over. Oh, and that's a win. Let's go. Love to see it. He does control his truck like a truck. This dude is a human semi. Can you believe it? If I ever want to get my truck's driving license, all I need to show them is a uh, completion of this game. He's got a dump truck, too. Now that you mention it, Steven is caked out himself. Probably from receiving all of those sausages. Hmm. I'm not going to think too much about this right now, but what I want to do is get you to go down. What I could do is even push you here right now, because then what I could do coming back is bring this sausage across, bring this up, and then entirely get you out of the way. I don't know if that's exactly where I want it, though. I haven't thought about where exactly I would like the location to be, because I realize that you, whoop, that's not what I wanted to do. You want to go here. So what I almost want to do is take the sausage and bring it to the bottom right. Can you now push in the water? That's a good question. No. Uh, but what I can do is push it down. Will it let me, though, is the question. Like, I want to see if I can just access the other sausage at all. Like that. Yes. 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 All right, so here's the catch. You have to actually make it back to the teleportation thing in order to pass the level. That's kind of scary. I, I could totally foresee a future where I solve the sausages, but can't make it back to the start. How or who plans to eat these? Well, I'm feeding you guys after the stream. Duh, that's why you all came, right? All hungry for sausage. The vertical one is the tricky one in my eyes. What if the vertical one actually needs to go down? So let me first move this like so, and do, then do a super move like this. The only thing is I'm pretty sure this top sausage is now stuck. But what I wanted to do with this sausage was bring it down here and then have this go twice like that. But I've, I feel I can't win this. Like I can get three quarters because, and the extra burner there is to screw that solution. But the super move I feel is important. So I want to rethink the horizontal one just a little bit. Can I do a different super move? I could do something like this. Don't want to bring it down or anything. Here's a different idea. I'll even reset. I don't know. Let me, let me try like a couple different ideas, right? This could actually work for this. Oh, wait, this wins. This just straight up wins. Let's go. Let's go. All right, so we didn't need to super move, but the super move was cool. It's weird how, like, the map kind of morphs into the puzzles as if it's some weird dream. Are the sausages even real? What even is a sausage? But that's it for Steven's Sausage Roll. On to the next game of the shit show.